One of my favorite things about running Android is the ability to customize my launcher, customize my workspace. Now, one of the things that I've not done a whole lot of lately in terms of customization has been custom icon packs. And this is primarily because I've been running a lot of foldables and the launcher you're going to use on your foldable probably doesn't support custom icon packs. Now, a lot of these devices like this OnePlus Open, like the Pixel Fold, like the uh, Galaxy Z Fold, you can go into the settings and Android will try to theme your icons for you based on your wallpaper and things like that. But it just never works right because I have too many icons that don't have a themed version from Material U. And because of that, I cannot stand having a bunch of themed icons and then one or two or three or four that aren't themed. It looks ridiculous. Why am I talking about this? Well, because there is an alternative launcher out there. I've talked about multiple times and they have kind of just solved this problem that for whatever reason, Google has been unable or unwilling to solve. With this new update to Niagara launcher, you can theme your icons with their own built-in icon packs and every icon is going to get themed regardless of if there is an icon made for it or not. The only downside to this is that it is part of Niagara Pro, which you can see the price of here, $10 a year or a lifetime purchase of $30. So not too crazy, 10 bucks a year is fairly negligible. You can read their reasoning for why they're subscription based if you wanna do that, but again, it's part of Niagara Pro. It works pretty well. You're gonna have to decide for yourself if it's worth it. Let's take a look. So this is obviously my OnePlus Open. We're gonna come over here. We're gonna open up Niagara Launcher. And as you can see here, I have all of my icons nicely themed. And the one that I really want you to look at is ones like my banking application, or how about TikTok, or how about uh, CX File Explorer. There you go they all have themed icons. Now what you should pay special attention to is the fact that my banking app is just a circle. Why is that? Because it didn't know what that was. So it's basically trying to theme icons based on categories. It knew this was a file explorer, so it gave it an icon that makes sense for that. It didn't know what this was, so it just gave it a circle. But honestly, I think I'm okay with that. So let's look at how this actually works. Let's come up here and let's long press and go into our settings. And you can see here under look, we have our icon packs and there are some different options here. So Niagara dots is one that they've had that is give basically a colored dot for each icon. There is sticker and there is watercolor. So this is the sticker one as you can see here. And you have app colors, coral, opal, and then theme colors. So different options there for that. I think that this looks kind of fun, kind of interesting. Let's go down to watercolor. Let's get a nice close look at what that looks like as well. Again, app colors or the themed color. And even as if with a the theme color, they're sort of moving around and doing some interesting things there. So that is pretty cool. Let's try this sticker one real quick. And we're gonna go with the themed colors and let's hit continue. And it's gonna change those for me. And there you go. Those are now my icons. I think that that actually looks pretty good. But again, the big thing is that it's theming every app, whether or not there's a custom icon made for it or not. Now, of course, you can also go in and change the theme color and it'll show you your material U colors, the wallpaper colors down there. We're going to leave this on auto, but you can change it to whatever you want it to be. There's also a section for wallpapers. Now, this is going to take you to your own wallpapers, but this one here will actually take you to a Google Photos album of their own wallpapers meant for Niagara launch or some of these might be interesting to you. All in all, I think that this gives you a way to have a really nice cohesive look for your device. And like I said, it works on every icon, something that for whatever reason, Google has not yet done. So there you go, guys. Maybe Google can take a cue from Niagara launcher and do something similar. How hard would it be to build in maybe 10, 15 different icons that if an app doesn't have a material U variant, they can just slap that on there and run with it like that. I think that would be really nice. And maybe then I wouldn't have to look at my friends posting their screenshots on threads and Twitter and so forth of their beautifully themed desktops uh, and be jealous because I could just do it myself and keep all the icons, all the apps, I should say, that I like to use on my home screen. Guys, thanks for watching. Go check out Niagara Launcher in the link 
in the description down below. I'll see you on the next one. And until next time, stay nerdy, my friends.